I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose my mind. I just get out of the shower. I can't, I can't even do anything in peace because Anthony Davis can't play a back to back. And here's the thing. Here's the thing. I want to get mad at AD, and it's obviously frustrating. And he should be able to play back to backs. But that's not news. That's not surprising. So of course, this incompetent franchise, that is the Los Angeles Lakers, ran him out there against Memphis, a game that was significantly less winnable than the one at Oklahoma City. The difference in being a double digit underdog nearly and going out there and actually being favored in the game against Oklahoma City, they now can't play AD on a back to back. Now favored to lose again. This, this is incompetence. This is what incompetence is. Be honest with yourself. If he's not playing back-to-backs, you rest him on the front end. This is how you miss the playoffs. It is embarrassing. You, and you could see this coming a mile away. How do, they, how do they mess up the simplest things in the world? The simplest things in the world. Well, now we get to see if Austin Reeves and Vanderbilt can pull out one of the most important games of the Lakers season. Uh, just so, so bad. What's up, y'all? Coach Joe here. I just wanted to kind of give a quick breakdown and some some thoughts regarding the Lakers last night. And it's particularly regarding Coach Ham, man. A lot of us, including myself, have tried to be patient with him. I understand he's a rookie coach, and so we're trying to have grace. And usually rookie coaches are not put in situations where they're expected to win now, right? So that's a given, but it is what it is. You're on the Lakers, you're expected to win. And so you got the roster now where the expectation's high. So, so when he underperforms and when he doesn't, uh, know how to adjust and when he doesn't have good rotation schemes and it, those are the things that piss us off like why is Mo Bamba not getting the minutes why is Dennis getting so many minutes why you know what I'm saying there's so many things why is Rui not starting last night like there's just so many things that you could pinpoint regarding coach Ham and so like we're trying to be patient guys but then there's a whole other group that's pissed off and, and those are the ones that got the memes out right now with his hands in his pockets but the fact of the matter is guys like there's no excuses like, I don't care if you're a rookie coach. You're on the Lakers. And, and it's part of his problem and, and um, in, in the, the front office problem for not hiring guys on his bench to have experience like like a Jason Kidd or like a Lionel Hollins. Like, he needs guys to bounce him out because the bottom line is he stinks in game, in game adjustments. And that scares me because when the playoffs comes, he's not going to be able to adjust in a seven-game series. He's just going to get smoked by a coach and have his hands in his pocket and be prideful because he doesn't want to adjust because they're going to adjust. Like, bro, like, what is that? I don't want to hear no more rah-rah pep talk speeches. I don't want to hear none of that. I want to see results, guys, because these are the games that we got to win. And Ham, you got to step up your game, son. You got to step up.